Somehow it's impossible to be English without being afflicted by the most terrible strawberry nostalgia. We all cling on to this belief that there was a time when life was good and strawberries really tasted of strawberries, sweet and red and juicy, and holding the whole of summer in their buried centre. Yeah, but we all know it's not always like that. I mean, sure, when fruit's as luscious as this, you want to eat them as they are, just untouched. But for the rest of the time, they need a bit of help. I love to use a reader's tip that I picked up from a newspaper to make strawberries fragrant with rose water. Helen halve a couple of punnets of strawberries and sprinkle over a spoonful each of caster sugar and rose water. Cover with cling film and leave to steep for an hour or so at room temperature before eating as they are or over ice cream. Wimbledon meets the Arabian Nights heavenly. And I adore this classic Italian way of bringing out the natural sweetness of strawberries. Chop them roughly, sprinkle with sugar and macerate in a few drops of best quality balsamic vinegar. Once flavoursomely soused, spoon them on top of cream dolloped good shop bought meringues. One messy bite and you're lost. For me, strawberries are the taste of lyrical, wide-skied summer, and this drink is the essence of that. Blend strawberries with sugar to taste to a puree, and top up with a bottle of Prosecco or other fizzy white wine. For me, a strawberry fragonard is the spirit of summer.